AV Cato's motto this year is we are one. And what that looks like each day is we are really shifting from the mindset of a specific student belonging to a specific teacher. We are shifting that mindset to the second a student walks onto our campus, they belong to a community and they will forever be a part of that community. So we are continuing our second year of PBIS here at AVCATO, which stands for Positive Behavior Intervention Support Systems. There's a big benefit to having PBIS on the campus because we've seen a drop in discipline referrals and the purpose of PBIS is to establish a culture and community of respect amongst parents, students, and teachers alike. Um, this year we have changed um, our campus environment, uh, starting off with our Lions Pride Pledge, which Pride stands for uh, Prepared, Respectful, Independent, and Dedicated to Excellence. Uh, we also have hallway biomes. Every hallway was assigned a different biome. Um, we also have a reward system where every week classes are giving points based on their, their positive behavior, and on Fridays we choose a winner for every grade level. Dina Gary. I'm the interim counselor at AV Cato. I've had the pleasure to implement a new program, Watchdog Dads, for the 2017-2018 school year. The acronym DOGS, meaning Dads of Great Students, is an educational, family, and community engagement initiative that builds bridges from the community back to our school. Watchdog Dads gives the fathers an opportunity to be in the classroom, providing educational activities, as well as being positive male role models. My name is uh, Jose Mejia, father of uh, Jareli Mejia. I like the watchdog program because it gives me the opportunity to come and spend a half a day or a whole day with my daughter in her classroom. I get to uh, see uh, who her friends are, put a face to the names that she mentions at home. And uh, most importantly, I like to come and help out those kids that are uh, in need of a little one-on-one uh, -on -one assistance in the classroom. In our second year of using Achieve 3000, I have seen impressive increased student success. Many of my students have increased Lexile levels by over 100 points. Reasons for this growth include students already being familiar with the program, assigning of high interest articles, as well as them working towards incentives and rewards. What I like about Achieve is that like, the articles, they're really interesting and like, Last week, like, there's this thing that our school was doing for, like, Achieve, and it's, like, if you got 75% or higher on 14 activities, then you could go to a movie. Hi, I'm Miss Elmi, and I'm a fifth grade teacher here at El uh, AB Kato Elementary. And I am here with our Spelling Bee winners. This is Adrian Gomez. He's a fourth grader from Miss Lerma's class. And this is Joel Lopez. He's a third grader from Miss Perez's class. So how much did you have to study before the Spelling Bee? Well, I had to study 30 minutes every day. For yeah. like the whole month ahead of time? Yes. Okay, how about you? Uh, as well, I had to study 30 minutes for this time. And that's a lot of hard work and dedication, guys. And were you nervous being in front of the whole f third, fourth, and fifth grade? Not much. Yes. He says yes. <laughs> and how did that make you feel when everyone was cheering for you? Mm, I felt courage because like my class was cheering for me. Ah. I felt uh, less. I felt less nervous. Well, good. And I just wanted to say congratulations to you both for um, all of your efforts, and I'm sure you'll be representing us well in the Area B on February 9th. I'm a 
piece to the puzzle, but together we, we 